and saw a bunch of tails rolling around over here tarpon tails let me see if they are around if they're looking to play I've got a all about the bait schmino rigged with a circle hook I think they started moving in Oh, there they are over there. See them? That sparkle there? That is them. Alright, moving. Right over there. There, you can see that one rolled. Yeah, there's a bunch of them. I can even see the silver sides under the water. The tide's really high so they can get up. Gotta cut them off. Try to hit them right in that circle there. boys at tide is ripping oh there they are I can see them cutting across there oh no oh, he's coming they're coming he was following it look at all of them nothing to see here oh now they saw me yeah, that was not quite stealthy, but they did follow. It's hard to kind of present anything in here because the current's run, running so fast. There's a big school of them. Can't even see them. There they go over there. They're cutting right across the, there. There's got to be a massive school right here. I changed up to a five inch fluke. A little bit bigger profile since it's hard to see in here. Oh, there they are, right there. Plus I can get more distance. Oh, right there. I'm a little bit behind now, but there should be more of them. Look at all of them, look at all of them. Come on. Oh, right there. Anything, anything? Can't see them. I'm just kind of blind. Oh, there's one there. So there's got to be a school right through here. Pretty long chain of them. Oh, I see them going underneath there. Yep, they're there. Oh, that wasn't good. Let it sink. One of you guys got to eat it. Eat it. Oh, that spooked them. Oh, 
That spooked them. They took a swipe at it. Wow, there was like a lot of tarpon on the flats today. Too bad I can't see them. I can't see them very well. Well, so the plan today was to go out to the back country, way back out there, towards the content keys, because I have no damn sense. But I could leave earlier today and then uh, catch the high tide so I could hit those uh, white sand flats and be able to check those out. And then uh, I really want to kind of learn that outside edge there, but I don't want to get trapped. So it was a good time to be able to get out there at high tide and then leave early enough where I can come straight back across. I don't think I would worry about the snook holes or anything like that, but then I saw these clouds running right along the sun path forever, forever from Key Largo to Key West, which means there's not going to be any sun. So I just said, ah, screw it. I'm not going to drive all the way out there and then have to boat it all the way out to the end to check the flats and not be able to see. So I cut it off early. I think I'm going to go run to the uh, bonefish spot and then just hang out there and see what I could do. But then I saw these tarpon, so I might have to change it up. I'll play with these guys a little bit more, so that's our plan. Well, with the high tide, no sun, this flat stuff is done for a little bonefish. There's just no way to see them. So my next plan is to go back to where I saw those tarpon but go and find a big white sand patch and just sit on the white patch because at least I'll be able to see. So, yeah. We'll have to kind of hopefully the, uh, the clouds burn off somewhere and we get some visibility. I don't know if that was a tarpon or a permit there. Oh, he turned. That's just a juvenile tarpon out here with the big boys I can catch him in the mangroves not what we're looking for though looking for much mas grande all right there's one right there oh, I cast past it dang it getting too much air not paying attention oh that's a man he's moving out of there like that. There's one right there. Oh, turned him. He did not like that. Not interested. All right. These are little guys. Surprised they're so wary. Whole chain of them right here. Single little guys, what the hell is this deal with these little teeny weeny dudes? Sneaking up on me. Well, the tide has changed. Now we're going wind against the tide. So it's gonna make it really rough and then not being able to see very well without any sun. So I think I'm gonna go to the Gulf side, 
play with the juvenile tarpon a little bit if they're around wait for this uh these clouds to hopefully pass and then uh, see if the wind knocks down as well and then uh, maybe get back to those bonefish or the tarpon most likely the bonefish all right i see some tarpon right there fortunately i think they see me now too He wanted it. They saw me. That wasn't good. Got to have your rod ready. Uh, there's one. He's coming out. See how far he's willing to come out. I'm just going to sit underneath that tree there. Can't hit him. Oh, oh, that might work. That might work. That's not going to work. Oh, gulping. Here they come. Oh, he's looking at it. Oh, oh, missed him. Dang it. <laughs> that again pulled it out of his mouth it doesn't help that these stinking rods are Can you see it I gotta get positioned a little better here all right I moved down a bit they seem to be happy again now that they don't know I'm here. All right, current is coming this way. That's why they'll be heading that way. I was sitting up there, but that's right in their line of sight. So I came out and behind it. So hopefully, they'll come back out. They were playing right there. Where they? Oh, I see his tail. He's farther up there. Oh, I need more line. Yep. Long shot. I think he's still there. Oh, I don't know if that spooked him or not. It was right over there. I don't see him. It's about the right spot. A little close though. All right, sun has cleared up. Those clouds went away. Uh, current has changed it's going out going towards the Atlantic so let's see if we can find some of these bonefish while the tide is somewhat higher it's dropping really fast but let's see if we can see some in these pockets here there's only one guy out and they're going for tarpon so I'm gonna be on the inside looking for these dudes I'm going straight for the quarter ounce uh, bonefish jig head because of the amount of wind. But the wind seems to be coming this way, so I would be casting downwind. I could probably get away with the 1 8. But for now, we're going to start with the quarter. The water's pretty ripply, so I don't have to be too stealthy. We'll go from here. Freaking A, there's one right there in front of me. I scared him. Where did he go? Drop the paddle, kick the... That was just totally bad. 
little one, but he was just feeding, sitting there. I think I saw one. Oh, that was a another fish. I saw one. Where'd he go? Where the hell did he go? So hard to see. Oh, there's a bunch of, look at all the bonefish. Look at all those bonefish. Oh, they're trying for it. Bunch of bonefish. Oh, they keep hitting it. Oh, okay, now I know where they're at. All right, I saw a big old school of uh, bonefish. Nice ones in here. So I'm going to try to set up in front of them. It was right up here. Pretty sure it was. Going too fast here. There was a lot of them. I think I'm gonna drop right here. Cause I think they were just, just up there. I'm gonna drop an anchor here. Oh, there's that pipe. So it was just past there. Let's see if I see him show up. Oh, I think I see some there. Yeah, I think I see them right there. Yeah, they're all right there. It, the current is ripping and it's deep. Oh, where'd they go? I don't see them anymore. Oh, something bit it. I see one down there. It was swimming. Man, there was like 20 or 30 of them. Where'd they go? Must have spooked them. Oh, there's one right there. Oh, there's a couple of them. There's the school of them. There's the school. Oh, that spooked them. Get it down right to and right in front of their face. Oh, they're looking at it. They're all over it. Why didn't they eat it? Stop, gotta stop. I'm gonna run right over them. They're right there. I didn't see them in time. I'm just, oh, there they are. There's a whole school of them right there. I 
I think I spooked them. Oh no, they're right next to me. Look at them down there. Get off, get off weed. Get off weed. For the love of God. Look at them down there. Right below me. Get down, down, down. Oh. That spooked them. That spooked them. Falling down on their head is not very good. Oh, there's one there back down. Yeah, a couple of them. Let me get it farther up there. All right. And we're just going to try to bring it across. Where'd they go? Oh, 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 he's looking for it. Oh, they wanted it. They're looking for it. I think one's got it. No. That current is just too fast. So as I push down and then they push, oh no, the whole school of them is right below me. Okay, get it down, get it down, get it down. Eat it, eat it. Oh, it's way up there. I can't, can't get it down to them. All right, they're in that hole right there again. Look at all of them. I need to get it in front of them without those dang weeds. All right. No weeds. All right, they should be on it. Oh, that spooked them. That just spooked them. Look at that. Just takes it right to the top. I could see them just sitting right over there. Get it down and bounce it right over to where they're at. Eat it, eat it. There it goes. There it goes. Oh, loosen that drag. Gotcha, gotcha. Gotcha. Oh, it came off. It, she shook it out of his mouth. I set the hook. I didn't set it hard enough. Golly. All right, so the uh, bonefish is the game over. So I'm gonna see if I could get a quick tarp in here to round out the day. The day of almost. Where are you tarpons? I just saw you guys. Oh, there they are right there. Get way out in front of them. There we go. Oh, any of them? Anybody? Anybody? Oh, he's interested. Oh, he turned off. He said, Nope, don't trust you. Stranger danger. All right, come here. You guys can go long, but I can go longer. I'm gonna go look for it. Oh, we have a looky loo. Nope. Saw my leader. 
Oh, they were coming out. There it goes. Back on them. Now they're freaked out. <sighs> now they don't want to have anything to do with me. All right, let's go long. Right there. There, I scared them. That freaked everybody out. And they go over there. Scared all those minas over there. Come on, boys. I want to go home. All right, there's one there. Oh, 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 dig it. I wanted to go home. That was the one. I pulled it out of his mouth. God, that was perfect. Perfect. And I screwed it up. I could see his mouth open up and go inside his mouth and I yanked it out. Caramba. This guy represents my fishing today, just floundering. Oh, what's up? Oh, floundering, I say. Oh, great, a storm's coming. Uh, I gotta hit that spot and get my tarpon. Ooh, look at the rainbow. Look at the storm coming. So I think I'm gonna forget that last tarpon spot, head back in, or at least I'm gonna do a, uh, give a boat launch tarpon a shot, then call it. I'm just out of sync today. Just not working right. So let's head back over there. All right, the boat launch tarpon are all tucked away, trying to stay out of the wind. Ugh. Saw a few back there, but they're like way underneath these uh, bushes. I'm gonna get stuck here. Wind against the current. So that's it. I'm calling it. It's done. Today was done before it even started. Oh, there they go. I spooked them out. Oh, there's one right there. Oh, I'm doing good here. There he is. Come on, just come in closer and just say hi and get a video and oh, look at all of them. Look at all the tails right there. And that full bodied one and scared one over there and look at that mud I made for them. They're gonna like that. There goes one. Oh can't get back to the launch. What a bad, bad, bad. Not good. Uh, I think we made it. Freedom! Alright, we are packed up, ready to go. Still plenty of sun left, but I had to stick a fork in it, man. I was done. It was just out of sync from the beginning. Got my snook shirt on and then I went kaput right off before I even got off US-1. So I'm still debating on whether I should have just stuck with it and went out there. The clouds cleared up, but it got windier than I thought it would be. Plus, I don't know if I would have got stuck trying to get back again, which would have been a horrible, horrible mistake three times in a row. Uh, but today was still rough. I mean, I, I found bonefish in the wrong spot. The bonefish spot I wanted to hit, nothing. Uh, even though I stayed within less than a mile from the boat launch, I still put in two liters of gasoline, which is about 20 miles. So I did about 20 miles today within one mile of the boat launch. I was just so out of sync. I had no plan. I was just going back and forth trying to do something, but just doesn't work trying to do too much but uh anyways thanks for watching and i will see you next video fishing in the keys is hard <laughs> bye